today we want to announce to the all public and the entire world, to the Republic of Southern Sudan and the entire world of mixed martial arts, April 27, we're going to have first the international mixed martial art. James Majog will be taking on Brazilian and the rest of the fighters will be taking some Ugandan. We we'll call it the East African MMA Challenge 2024. And at this event, you're going to see fire. South Sudanese at the best. We miss the, I mean the All African game and the guys being so ready. So we want to take that fire out of them and make sure we promote the nation and we want to go number one everywhere we go. This event is being prepared by the, uh, the Federation itself, you know, as, as one of my uh, privilege to be a coach and also the president of the Federation. Um, this young man will show that, you know, they will show the best of their talent. The mixed martial art is a combination of kickboxing, tie boxing, and of course, uh, wrestling. Some of the Africans have very good wrestling background, and we want to show the world that South Sudan, Sudan has biggest root in when it comes to wrestling. We have the big wrestling in the whole world. And mind you, if you go back to the history of mixed martial arts, of the combination of the art of self, you go back to Nimrod, and you go back to the history of this sport, it started here in the Nile. And we are blessed to be part of this mixed martial art world because we are also the history and we are the history makers. So I am here to have this opportunity and bring it live to all South Sudanese, world and Africa. Our, our champions are going to be the best. And again, we don't want to miss this. A nice showdown, you know, I'm already excited. Bam, bam, and getting in there. The event will be on the 27th of April at Nakron Cultural Center at the Theater Hall. It's going to be inside this time. And it's start from 2 o'clock. And mind you, my time 2 o'clock is 2 o'clock. So if you come late, you'll find the event is done. I know Ugandan will come because their national teams are coming here. I want Brazilian champion. And I want all South Sudanese to turn out in big number. Don't stay for one free thing. Come and support your champions. Through your support, these guys can go higher, you can elevate them, the name of the country will be higher, and the world will know what is South Sudan, and the other ways, not from the war, but from the sport building part of it. Woo! Woo! I'm too excited, and I'm waiting for that day to come. My name is Wizi MJ. My real name is Ben Goton. I'm a South Sudan professional kickboxer, Thai boxer. I'm now I'm in MMA. I am really appreciate what is coming up. So I'm ready for the fight, actually. I'm going to take it. Right now, we are under like, a camp training responsible by our coach. As you can see, the situation of the country is so hard. But they manage now. We are under the camp. I think we are almost one month now in here. We are just training and getting prepared for the fight. Like, you know, South Sudan is full of a lot of uh, stuff. Like, people are not all OK. We have a lot of challenges, actually. Let me say, like, uh, part of the training is only one person who is providing for the, all the team, only one guy, the coach, okay? The master is the one providing everything. And you see, we don't have promoters who are promoting our fights. We don't have even responses, those guys who can support us at least to give us some equipment or provide us with some food, like, to sustain us for a short time for training. So actually, we have a lot of challenges, like, we don't have a past eight people here. We don't have a full medication system in our place. So it's only him. When somebody gets injured, he has to take his own resources and treat individuals which is affecting our system and is the only person promoting the muscle art all over the country what i can say to the federation let's be cooperative with the fighters try hard at least to push us because we are ready to represent the country it matters a lot for a man like me to carry the flag on his shoulders so we sacrifice everything we thank our coach for everything but i'm just 
saying like if federation can at least assist us like to get to to put hand together with the coach and get for us some fight outside at least we can at least push our Sudan to the next level because he's ready to, to give us whatever he has he's a legend he's an icon so we're going to benefit a lot from him we will cooperate